morning, we're in Universal again. So, for a weekday, it's quite busy. Well, it's busy at security. So, it's a bit of a later start today. So, after our late finish last night at Magic Kingdom, we had a little bit of lighting. A lot of alarm slept through. But uh, we're going to be here at about 3 o'clock ish. We're going to go to Walmart and then we've got the annual reservation at 50 prime time. So, I'm fantastic as well. We've also got our alien spoil and sauce today, haven't we? So, the answer is checking times. We're going to head to Islands of Adventure first of all. We're going to go and do our forbidden journey. So, if you can see, Athlete Rams. Please see if it's 10 minutes when we get there. So it's down at 10 minutes at the moment, so we'll see if it's 10 minutes when we get there as well. So it's a nice warm day again today. So it's not too sunny at the moment, so it's sun was shining a wee bit before. Let's say. The shrimp and bubble gumps out there have an opportunity as well. <laughs> but now, they walk pretty cool today. I imagine this is what um, Disney Springs is like. Yeah. I like that. So it's like barely anyone being starved. Yeah, it does seem a lot more grown up than anything we've seen at Disney. So, which way are we going, Liani? We're going to Island Adventure, so we're going straight ahead. Last time we feared to the right. The right. So I'm going straight, straight ahead, all the way down, all the way to Hogsmeade. Straight on, aren't we? So we're going to get some merch. Well, sorry about that. I was pointing it down on my cross then. So trying to get a virtual, trying to get a virtual line as well. Um, not working. Not working. So for Fast and Furious, we don't know if we're going to get on it today. So we have no return time at all. So we're heading this way anyway. It was like that last time though. Yeah. We had no problem getting the Jimmy Fallon one. But Fast and Furious, for a ride that people don't really like either. It's a bit of a crazy one that we can't get a, uh, a virtual line for it. Though, That's true. It's new for a lot of people, but for a lot of people just don't want it with the talent here. Oh wow. Yeah, good wow. So there we are, heading to Islands of Adventure now. We've not been through this way. No, we haven't been through this gate yet. The last time we got to Islands of Adventure through the Hogwarts Express. Today we're doing it the first way, aren't we doing it the opposite way? Just noticed some Dragon Ball Z pops there that caught my eye. Hmm. That's pretty cool. Margaritaville! Is that where you want to be right now? 20 past 10 in the morning, so you can always think about it's margarita, and tequila. <laughs> Making sure I get her um, I get her ID with me as well, so they bring her along, because she wants that an alcoholic drink. So we've not had too many issues actually with um, with the actual uh, being ID. I think there's only once at Tepanido. Yeah. Everywhere else we haven't. We might have got done at uh, sci-fi, but we went for milkshakes instead. So, we're getting there now, you can see it. It is really cool, it's a lot cooler than um, Ent Entry to Universal Studios, nothing. There's a lot more theme in this way. A lot of people in robes as well. Where are your robes, the Annie? I have them there too, have they? Don't envy anyone who's wearing robes. Because they're so warm. Uh, are we looking at fast pass times? Yeah. 10 minutes, so that's not bad. So, we're going to get ourselves through. Fast pass. Fast pass. No, queue time, sorry. You got Disney um, stuff in me, other. So you just check your favorite fast passes. So the queue is quite long here, so I'm gonna stop. Them. I don't think it'll be ten when we get there. No. By the time we force away through, it's about 25 minutes, half an hour. I can see it's manic. So I'll stop recording and then we'll get back to you later on.
I've never been down this part, it's so cool. So we just walked past Puss and Boots. It is. And look at this, there's a Christmas store as well to go in. But no, the theme is amazing around here. And so, obviously we've seen the theme around uh, Hogsmeade and their Diagon Alley and Jurassic Park and all that, but even this, this little first bit here to step into it, it's incredible. And you're warm. It's very warm, isn't it? You know, we're heading... Yeah. We're heading straight down Jurassic Park, there's fair right and go there. So we should be there then at Hogsmeade. Hope. Our plans have been scuppered by a... Oh yeah, maybe go this way. Our plans were scuppered by a leak. Yeah. Damn, damn your universe on your leak. Oh. I lost the Annie for a second then. I was looking for some ears, and there was no ears. So we're entering into Seuss Land, aren't we? Well, Leanne's going to want to go on all the rides here yes. in Seuss Land, then, but... We need to go to the castle first. <laughs> yeah, that's the priority. Go to the castle first, and then after that, do other rides you want to do. But for now, there's one ride she wants to do first. Which ride's that? A bit of journey. She doesn't really, she doesn't want to do it at all. It's scary. She's petrified. It's under the wee arm. I'm just going to try and pretend it's a simulator. Okay. You'll be alright. It's so cool in this area, isn't it? It's beaming. You might find Flat Stanley here. But yeah, so we learned about Flat Stanley. About a child that was flat and he, he goes around with kids on trips. And they say, Google it, you're probably better off doing that than I was trying to desc describe who Flat Stanley is. So cool around here though. See all the topiaries. Oh, this is a Lomax. So cool. I'm not really into this too, so I don't know the other ladders. I just know that that was a low max. The Lorex, is it? I knew the one that was probably say Danny DeVito. I, I call him the low max. I'm awful for this. But who was the other lad? No, Dr. Seuss doesn't look like that. Dr. Seuss is a bit bad. Who's that? It's the Grinch. Grim, Grim just being sassy as anything today. <laughs> That's Leanne's spirit animal right there. <laughs> that was pretty cool. I, don't know, I think I think we chose the right way. It looks like we're heading into Hogsmeade a different way as well. Oh, this is pretty awesome. It's crazy how one theme room just blends into the next. Yeah. And where are we? Um, going into the side of this so,
So, um, I Uber driver recommended this last time, didn't she? Yeah. Sans Fury. Did I walk through it? Yeah. It does look pretty cool to be honest. Yeah, we didn't bend it down this side last time. We head straight up, don't we? Still on the check of the times again. How are we lucky, Ducky? Ten minutes less. That's good for us. I think she's gonna be knackered after this. Look at her. Panting already. We have like proper march that out from one side of the park to the other. There's a mate spin it around and towards a little bit now. There we go. See our faces for a bit now. Look how red it she is. Is it going to be worth it? I hope so. Me too. Let's see, but no. It's quite quiet around this area. Obviously, once we get into uh, Hogsmeade, it's going to be a different story once again. As they always seem to be busy in Hogsmeade. But here's not too bad and lots of content. And there we are, there's Hogsmeade there. Yeah. We're ready to go and ride it. Do, 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 do. This is the Hogwarts Express, Hogsmeade. The what? Hogwarts Express. That's not what you said. The, the Hogwarts. Hogwarts. There's the train station, Battle King's Cross. Get out later on. This is the face of the wife I married, the with my wife. And like I predicted, it's busy already. Through. No, it's you can actually walk through today. The other day, you just couldn't move, yeah. Yeah. it didn't help with the rain either. So, we're going to head that way. We might even get onto the flight of the hippogriff again. So, walk our way through. So Liani's got a wand unfortunately but we're going to be alright, we're not going to need it today I don't think. We'll bring it next week though. So unless she gets them chosen for one then she'll be like, oh my days, I'll have two ones instead. Yeah. On a ride like this? No. I don't think so. Oh, this is yeah. Obviously, I couldn't see me on it, but here we are. Hmm? We need to go to the lockers first. Hmm? Yeah, we need to go to the lockers. We've got to keep all our stuff in the locker. I forget this about um, Universal. No carrying anything on to so, uh, rides. So, lock the. Beautiful. So, I think I have a little bit more here. Now, obviously, we've got the lockers, I'm going to have to drop everything off in a minute. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you emotional? Yeah. As emotional as the other day? No, because I had swept my eye the other day. <laughs> I'm not going to have a repeat of the other day. There's Flight of the Hippogriff as well. And so and after this, I'm going to stop recording. We'll record after we come back off. Yeah, we'll catch you in the flip side. I went journey. shopping. Yeah, I went shopping. She's, you're wrapping the wrong household. So you're wrapping Hufflepuff. Um, we've just got off Forbidden Journey. <laughs> Absolutely loved it. It was incredible. So, yeah. One point I thought Leanne was going to cry. 20. 
Yeah. It's up to you. Do you want to do it? Yeah, we're here. Yeah. Thank you. And then we go over. Yeah, so how are we doing? So we're going to do a uh, like the hip grip and then we're going to head over. 20 minute wait is saying. I mean, it is going to be 20 minutes away. I remember it was quite uh, a snug squeeze on here. That's the only thing. But no, um, the bit of journey was amazing. There was times when I thought the animal was going to cry. Especially at the one from Willow. Yeah, it, not to ruin it for people, but it is quite intense. That's it. It's brilliant and you feel so safe and secure the whole time. But there is one point where your thing leans the whole way back so you're like horizontal. But apart from that, patch over there. We don't want to spoil it, spend anyone that's a thing. It's so good. I've seen lots of things. And the arm's gonna cry after you watch it. Yeah, boy, you're gonna cry at the end of it. And no one clapped on the table. Oh yeah, they did. Huh? I didn't know one clapped, but then the whole of the was clapped. Yeah, we clapped. Wasn't we? I clapped. <laughs> How many times? Lots. The queue for quite a hip is quite long, actually. Yeah. I mean, it's longer, a longer queue than it was the other day for us. Yeah. Studio stuff. Do all the studio stuff. Yeah. I want to just. one thing ticked off because we didn't get to do that the last day. No. That's why we made priority today to do it. Right. Give this a go. So the sun's beaming after I said it was quite um it was quite dull. The sun's came out now we hidden the shade. Look at you with your glasses and your hat. I think it was high. But yeah. <laughs> you think you were a towel? No. Then why you have to one? Are you a spy? Yeah. The beam in the queue line is amazing. Wish we could have filmed on the queue line in the actual bin journey. A bit on the show, but not a lot. It moved quite quickly. It did. It's about a 20 minute wait, so it wasn't really that bad. But now, we get to ride the hip. Hogsmeade, now we've just inflated a hip grip, it's a lot longer than it said though. Yeah, there's more than more 20. Than 20 minutes, yeah. But we've done it. It's, uh, it's so good, I enjoy it. Really good, I've just realised I've got my hat on the right way round. <laughs> I know, what kind of strange person wears the hat forward? Oh, this person here. Walking through Hogsmeade now. It's quite busy through Hogsmeade. Hoping when we get back to the other side it will be a little bit quieter. So how are you feeling about the morning so far, Liani? Good. I really enjoyed it. Yeah? yeah. You might see me into your face like I just did then. I love it here. Feel at home. Calmer than it was last time as well. Yeah. It's still busy. We've seen some of the queue times for the bigger rides and still. The Forbidden Journey is still 10 minutes. And the whole time we were here, last time it just didn't drop. Sunday? Yes, yeah, Sunday it didn't drop. It was like 40 minutes the whole time, so. Yeah. They say the biggest queue ride time is for like uh, Fast the and Furious in Kitty, Kitty One. Yeah, Fast and Furious is like 50 minutes. We can't get virtual lighting, so I don't even know if we're going to end up going on at this holiday. No, so we we'll try as soon as we get to the park and they're just all gone. It's a, it's a bit of a silly one, really. It is like everyone says, if it's a new ride, everyone's wanting to try it out straight away. Yeah. So we're heading to Hogsmeade now. Uh, Hogsmeade, Hogsmeade Station. Well, it's a little bit busy as well. Let's see. It's quite a queue. I don't know if they're just they're oh, checking. The yeah, they're checking tickets. So we're going to do a check and check. We'll be back with you. Nice and easy. Hopefully, it's going to be a 10 minute wait now. So you can see all the construction they're doing for the new ride here. It's going to be Hagrid's Hut. You can say it ruins a little bit. The magic doesn't have it in the background. Here's a Slytherin in a hat. Much forward to say, tell me where every song's from. Every fan we get to, she stops to take a little bit of cool air. <laughs> Let's look her 
floating around. Look at her thinking she's Neville. Or he's Neville dancing with you. Okay. Yeah, we're to Hogsmeade Station. So we've got to take the uh, scenic route so we're not using the express passes. I do miss fast passes. We can't win them all, can we, Pansy? We do get to take in a nice bit of the station, though. Nice bit of greenery. So what's the plan next, anyway? Yeah. Okay. Do I do want to hit up Simpsons Lime. I'm going to go for lunch there as well. Uh, twirl and hurl and there's all the lunch. Yeah. Um, that sounds like a plan. Like Spider-Man Spider-Man Spider Man's over here, isn't it? Spider-Man. Oh, yeah. Oh, we'll come back to the We'll see if we have time for it. We can always do it on the next trip. Yeah. Kong's like one of the busier rides, apart from Fast and Furious, isn't it? Even the Hulk isn't that long. The Hulk is the age as well. Kong's still relatively new. Yeah. So here we are. I'm just entering into so a little bit of shade now. And compared to the other day when it was raining, there's no queue at all there. But down here anyway, there's no queue. Not to say it's going to be a cute star, so. but this one's loving life really. She's in her element. A little Salazar sliver. Apparently, she can say it in either Spanish or Russian. So it's my daughter's having my shades. So there we are, this is music from Prisoner Azkaban. Oh, uh, walking, how you part of Wikipedia it doesn't need any uh, anything, any seconds to think about it, do you? It's um, when Lupin's talking to Harry about Lily on the bridge. I think. <laughs> anyway, so we'll stop the helmet now because we're going to be here on the reckoning in a minute. That's our trip over, we're back to London. Time to get the train back to Chester. Oh, Chester train's delayed. It's always delayed. To be honest, they've done so well with everything's cross, it does look like everything's cross. So, we're just oh, gonna... A lot cleaner than the real King's Cross as well. I love the first bus. One of Leanne's favourite things about having buskers at the entrance. Happy he wasn't playing Wonderwall. <laughs> it would have been more authentic if he was playing Wonderwall. I don't think what else we hear quite a lot as well. Zombie. Zombie. Nothing in Heaven's Door. And. What's your one? Stairway Whis to Heaven. Stairway to Heaven. And Whiskey in the Jar. Yeah. We hear a lot of Whiskey in the Jar as well. Windham! Night bus just there. It's a lesser square. So where are we heading now, Liani? Can we get a picture? Yeah, of course you can. Liani's going to have a picture with the night bus. Give me a second, I'm going to take off the board. So Liani went to the night bus and they seen she was a sliver him. And told her to stay out in Nocturne Alley. I wish I got that on film actually, that would have been pretty cool. I told them I had shares in Borgen and Burks and I had to go. And now we're going... Since it's up to half an hour, but Twirl and Hurl is insane. We're going to Twirl. We're going to uh, the best place. Do you want to do Twirl and Hurl, then get food, and then do the We could do, yeah. Although I have heard it's a little bit... Jolty, that's it, that's what I was worried about. I know you really want to do it, so I don't mind doing the half hour with it. Okay. We do Twirl Hill first. But 
I'm so excited. This is Rob's This is my So oh, I'm obsessed with Harry Potter and he's that guy. That looks amazing. It's a cool area though, right? Really cool. Oh my days. My face right now is like this. I'm so excited to be over here. So we're heading over to this, this big field. Look how cool it looks. But Liani doesn't mind it, but she's not as like. I like it, but I'm not obsessed with it. Sorry. Sorry. So, being in the habit of walking into children today as well. But no. So cool. Yeah, let's go do the Simpsons ride yeah. first. They got the Quickie Mart over there as well, so we're just going in here. I'm so excited. You're a happy little elf. You're a happy little elf. <laughs> You're a happy little elf. And we've just done both the Simpsons rides. Yep. So what did we do first? Uh, the Simpsons rides. And how do you find it? It's alright. It's a bit queasy. That's it. Good. After a while you do get a little bit queasy. I'm the same. I don't think the um, actual like, effects are as intense as when you think um, the Forbidden Journey. I think that like flings you about. I think the 3D's a little bit a bit weirder as well. It just makes it to me go a bit funny. It does. And then we went on a hurl and twirl and it started to rain as well. Yeah, that was fun. Just say so fancy. It started to rain when we were on hurl and twirl, which we enjoyed. A few people weren't fans of it, but we are sorry, we were quite relieved for it to be honest. Well I was anyway. I liked it. And we've just waited in the long queue of the day. Yeah, to get food. I went to Krusty. I went to Krusty Burger, and it took me forever. So, I went to the Frying Dutchman. Yeah, you went to the Frying Dutchman. So it still took forever. There was like two people ahead of me, and it still took forever because it was the slowest service ever. What? I love Universal, but we ain't got nothing on Disney's quick service. No, it's a bit chaotic. Best way to put it. Well, I went for the Quagga Burger and it was beautiful and so the secret sauce was amazing. It reminded me a bit of a mixture of uh, Big Mac sauce and Big Tasty sauce. And then I had curly fries with it. What do you I have? had a basket of beer and it could have done two people. It was massive and it was really yummy. It had coconut shrimp, cod, calamari, hush puppy, tater tots. Massive. And everything. And we even managed to get a uh, Buzz Cola as well, which is it's a cherry cola, isn't it? Yeah, and we got a donut that we're going to have later. Yeah, we'll show you that later on. So we're doing a couple more rides before we head off. So we're going to ET now, we're going to do ET. Hope to do Men in Black, and then I think we're going to call it a day then, aren't we? It's going to 20. Oh, it's going to 20 now. We're still here, so we might as well do it. I'm going to say, we just left us all at the Woody's, uh, the Woody's, uh, Woody Woodpecker. Bible. Bible from an American tale. Bible's playground. Oh, there you go. So we're going to have to do anyway. So we're going. We're in the, the standby queue again. Is this a 3D ride? No. It's really so, so I don't know if I could do another 3D ride at the moment. I need something a bit chilled. <laughs> Going. Is it 20 minutes? Are you a little bit confused? Are you confused, Liberin? This is what a 20 minute QA line at Universal looks like. No, it does not. Apparently so. We've been in a longer 15 minute QA. That's true. We don't know what's behind those doors, so. Anyway, we'll leave it for now and we'll see, we'll get back to it. Imagine if I wasn't recording all this. So it's just our BT. We rescued all the baby ET. Yeah, we've seen them all, they're all, they're all adorable. Really cute. Such a weird sensation of sitting on that bike seat on the ride. So it doesn't feel natural. Leanne was a little bit worried about a bag. Because nowhere to keep your bag secure, but it's not really like a wild ride. 
in that case. So we're just gonna head now to Men in Black and I think that's gonna be our last ride of the day. So we've gotta get back and do a Twill and Saucers at Hollywood Studios today. I keep forgetting what I'm gonna to say today as well. But yeah, we've gotta do a Twill and Saucers. We've got our, our dining reservation. I've completely lost a word here. We've also got Fantasmic as well. So, we're just looping around, I believe. So, I don't know how you move around, but we also, we've got the restroom just there anyway. So, yeah, I need to go to the restroom. I'm going to go and grab some more water. Maybe. We'll have a look on the app anyway. So we're back in a little bit. So we're just gonna do men in black now. I'm just waiting for the Annie to finish in the uh, ladies. So it's still quite a nice day. The clouds are peering over just over there, but if you look at this side, it's quite blue. So hopefully it's gonna stick more like this than not like that. And we've got a dining reservation later on there. Where have we got it? I can't remember. No, we've got it at 50's prime time, so we've got swirling saucers first, then we've got prime time, then we've got fast pass tickets so we can get a decent seat for Fantasmic as well. So, so we're just going to go warm up after this. And so we need to get some more elevator cream. So the sun's kind of damaged us. You can see I'm behind, uh, well I'm in front of Barney, as you can hear all the uh, nursery rhymes going on. Barney's just there, I'm wondering what you would catch that. And the security just there as well. So I'm currently snapping the other kids a bit. The Annie's looking for me. She's a little bit lost. Let's see if we can see her. She knows her alphabet. I do. Autumn taught me. Well done you. Well done Tootsie. Well done Tootsie. I was just tired but now we're going to go to Walmart. Were you? Yeah. yeah. It's an important job. If I didn't tell them, we won't remember. So, do you check the time for Men in Black? No. I guess we're not. I don't know how we get there though, because I don't think we go through there. This is curious, George. I think we need to go. I definitely see the time for it. Feel myself getting ambushed. The Woody Wood Pepper Ride. So it's a baby, baby coaster. How do you think my foot fit in that? I'm, my legs wouldn't fit in that. It's, it's a struggle getting into fight the hippogriff. See, so we're going back on ourselves now. Maybe they used to be. See, I think we've got to go back on ourselves. I think a lot of people have felt the same trip. Maybe they used to be like away. And the science not to change, so I don't know. There's Barney. There's Liani. Barney, Liani. I met my spray up there. I don't mind a bit of rain, bro. Say, well, look at those clouds. Yep, it's raining. Ready for another Florida downpour? I'm ready. You ready for a bit of rain, Liani? That's true. We'll wait and see. Men in black. This way. That's the, that's the place uh, Animal Atlas with the dog and Beethoven from, isn't it? So we take a shortcut for this way. Anyway, we'll be back to you when we get to Men in Black. So, off to Men in Black.
Hoping the queue time isn't too bad. So we're going to have a look before we uh, decide we're going to go on or not. So very much like Buzz Lightyear, so like Konami the Mover, apparently. So it might be a little bit easy for Leanne to beat me on this one. We'll have to wait and see.